The Cardinal Virtue of Prudence. Again, and if you missed the last episode, I'm pretty sure we're about to have a short chapter full of just a boss fight, but we will get some plot, so let's dive into it. Ooh, loading screens, everyone's favorite. Had to get myself some water. It's only April, but Texas weather, it's already hot. I'll be right back. Mommy! Mommy! I am Zero your blather. I'd much rather hear it straight from your boss. Ha ha! say, Paddy, I can that for long? He won't. For the thumb drop, for the thumb draws the long the witch hunts. Yes, I think. In some of the Emma's who play Iron Cosm, who fired the Posse, who are on the army, Gelda, who are on the Kaosu. All right, time for a gimmicky boss fight. It's not so bad. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Don't want to get caught in the middle of that little dive pool right there. A lot of defense that goes into this fight. A lot of dodging, a lot of waiting for your opportunity to strike. Like right now. Ooh. There we go. Say you just want to knock the faces off of this douchebag's legs. Oh, careful. Don't want to get hit. There we go. Got two of them in one go. That's not bad. Now if I can swing her. Oh, forgot you had missiles. You're a big angel thing living on the ocean. Why wouldn't you have torpedoes? Hmm. So more plot detail that was going on there. Obviously all these fucking angels answer to someone. A Lumen Sage. And as every boss is, I believe every single major boss, obviously, just the angels have alluded to after you beat them. They've all hoped, oh man, come on. Fuck off with your torpedoes. They've all uh, ended their defeats by saying, uh, may Jubileus grace you. So that's the, as we're learning, that's their objective. The goal of whoever's orchestrating with all the angels, the last of the Lumen Sages, whatever, is the resurrection of Jubileus. Which brings out a new era of creation or whatever again all standard standard end of the world kind of fair 
And look at this. Yeah, this also implies that I'm playing with the gamepad and I'm not. But if I were, I could tap the stylus with or whatever and use that to control. But that looks really annoying. Why would I want to do that? So much easier to use the pro controller for this game. I think it was designed for the pro controller personally. Especially because when you get so fucking angry, you don't want to end up throwing the uh, the gamepad. That'd be a mistake. Whereas the pro controller is fucking invincible. It's like I haven't even put a scratch on this thing in like a year. And that's after getting mad at plenty of games on the Wii U. Ooh. I think you're gonna sideswipe me all easy like that? Uh uh. Getting cheap hit after cheap hit. Nope. Get ourselves another climax. This is one of my least favorite ones, actually. Kind of dumb. It's just like, uh, you're centering, you're riding this guy and centering him towards your spider buddy. Oh, but this fight does end very coolly. Hopefully that's what's about to come up, but I might have to do a third round of this bullshit. We'll see. Or maybe not. Munch on him with the spider a little bit. Now what? Are you gonna do your thing? Or... Yeah, he's gonna do it. Alright, this shit's pretty cool. Yeah, he lost a bunch of health from that go-around. So we're in the last leg of the fight. And we're... Going down this, uh, what's the, uh, the term that's used for this? I would say half pipe, but it's more of a full pipe. That's a surfing term. We're just in this vortex of water, and we gotta dodge your lasers. That gives us witch time. We can, goal is to move forward and get close enough to where we can attack. All right, now I get cheap shots with him, with the guns. Come on, end your little eye laser thing. Come down here and fight me. Cool, here we go. Oh, oh, I thought I got witch time, but I guess not. Yeah, then you get pushed back somehow. I don't know. Don't know how that works, but I got my offense in. Now I gotta do it again. Ooh. Whoa, that one was close. Oh, got hit. Yeah, he's a little faster, that go around. Get more cheap shots in with the gun. Oh, I thought I dodged. Dodged that time. There we go. He is done. It's over. This should be a pretty good one. Ooh, that's fucking awesome. That is... That's rad. This is one of the best climaxes in the game. Oh, that is so fucking wicked. I love it. Seventeen hundred, wow. Oh, that's so fucking cool. The climaxes are so satisfying. I have no idea why you would want this stone. It would look absolutely terrible on you. Much too flashy. <laughs> Welcome.
Welcome aboard, Cheshire. Oh, fucking hell! Mummy! I told you I'd be right back. <laughs> Shouldn't you be, you know, flying this thing? I'm a bit occupied at the moment. Mummy! Mummy! Uh, uh, uh. Well, so much for the subtle approach. We might as well have speakers on this thing blaring Ride of the Fucking Valkyries. Come now, we're VIPs. You know, nothing says you've made it in life like a private helicopter. Then welcome aboard Air Luca, Flight 001. This is your captain, Luca, speaking. Fasten your safety belts, as this may be a bumpy flight. Oh, that's the end of that chapter. Again, short and sweet, just as I said it would be. Oh, another gold. I still haven't gotten a platinum on any chapters, because I take too much damage. Ooh, beat my records. Nice. Now we're going to have a short angel attack. Obviously didn't earn any bullets in that chapter. Ready, fire. Let's make it quick. Uh, oh, look at this. Bang. Just deliver that one on a silver platter, why don't you? Ooh, missed. Oh, well. Oh, I thought I had that one. Thought I had that one. Oh, well. Hmm. Not a good round. Oh well. 30, not bad. Hmm. Do I want to exchange? Eh, I might as well buy something. Now I have one of those. Hmm. And making our approach. towards the end of the game and I know it's coming up in the next chapter it's going to be a lot like uh, what was that one called route 666 where I did a lot of fast forwarding and I was on a motorcycle it's a lot like that one so I might be doing some fast forwarding in the next episode not inquire not entirely sure we'll see <laughs>